hey guys and uh, it might be the first time i'm just gonna say this is my channel or whatever but uh, i am not really into this video because i don't want to make this video but as with my stuff video to i feel like i really feel like it, it needs to be made because like on youtube i've seen no one talk about this and it's like a problem like the dude is still on the side he uploaded literally a day ago and everyone says about it except for this one other youtuber who i'll put their video like in the chat but anyhow i am uh gonna be talking about a man called Amor Atla. you may or may not have seen him he made this friday night fucking mod uh that got pretty popular and i mean i like i like the mod i even, I even listen to his music like it was good and all right but currently uh at the moment he is reasonably under fire for his pedophilic actions i think that's how you say it and yeah i want to just talk about that and let it all out and just i want to share everything that i know that i could i found this may not be the whole story but at the current moment, this is everything I found, and I'm just here to share it with you guys to spread information and spread the word. <sighs> Anyhow, uh, this before we can properly start this, we have to start back in Geometry Dash. A couple of years ago, Amor Atla, he was part of the Geometry community, and I hope that you're as surprised as I am to find out that Geometry Dash has its own separate community, but in seriousness he was part of like the geometry dash community and i heard it's like toxic i don't know but he uh was in a chat that included a 14 year old boy and a 12 year old boy was what i think who were, who had a non-sexual relationship and at the age of 16 he drew porn of them nah I hope that no one out there is like thinking that because he was 16, this was suddenly okay, but fun fact, if you make porn, even as a child, if you make child porn, you're still wrong. It's not an okay thing to do, but he did that and it was very obviously wrong and now he's very obviously out of the Geometry Dash community. He, he says like, oh, I left it because it was toxic. I'm pretty sure you were kicked out because you were doing child porn, but anyhow. Uh, I have no idea just what happened to uh, that those that fourteen year old and twelve year old. I hope they're okay, but I can't really find them. I try my best, but yeah. Then yeah, Amor later moved on to the Friday Night Fucking community, which is pretty popular nowadays. And you know, everything was going fine in Friday Night Fucking community, and I'm pretty sure that this is the point where he became an adult. Because like we, when he did uh, that in Geometry Dash community, he was 16, but I'm pretty sure like from this point on, see this as an 18 year old full grown adult man, all right? And yeah, in the Friday Night community, this uh, girl, her name is A4DX, I hope I didn't slaughter that, but this A4DX person, they groom a minor, which, <laughs> not good, and they of course, very reasonably, get cancelled. Twitter cancelled. There was a, even their own like cancel party. He should have been there. And yeah, uh, Amor and this other person who is the owner of an OC known as Blue or also known as Fanboy Mordecai. That's just what they are. Uh, they reach out to uh, Afer because they think that everyone deserves a second chance. But uh, <laughs> Things don't go as planned, things don't go very proud, and of course, everything just sort of... <sighs> Anyhow, I point on. Amor is stolen adult, right? Remember that, remember that. Amor is stolen adult, right? And I hope you haven't forgotten about that uh, blue person, right? I, I, they have a name, but I just know them by cash. So I'm just keep calling them blue. This blue person, right? They are in a call with this minor called... <laughs> they have to specify. Minor called Mini who is at the time of like that event happening 16 years old so underage is like how Amor likes them and now they're 16 year old and according to this uh on 
on the dock that this loop was made. According to them, they were making a sexual joke with Minnie, and then Omar was like uh, asked to draw porn of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, say it with me. And then, and then he did. And if you remember what I said, Minnie is 16, and the other person was the blue person, right? They're 19, and Amor is 18. Minnie is like a child here. The other two are adults, and Amor drew. I am, I'm struggling to work this. I because I don't want these words to come out of my mouth. But Amor drew sexual images of Minnie, him, and Blue all just. And. Ugh. That is very disgusting. But, uh, this blue person said they thought he would never leave the group chat, but then Omar he uh, made like his an own separate Twitter account just to post post all of the CP's drawing. I yeah, if that sounds ridiculous, that's because it is. It's very stupid. It's very ridiculous. <laughs> Anyhow, that's about where. Blue ends up finishes coming into play with this Amor scandal. Uh, anyhow, <laughs> other words to a 15 year old. Now, I'm I'm pretty sure like this is from the 15 year old, but I'm pretty sure Amor knew they were a child, right? Amor asked to see their talking about why why is censored at this point. Amor asked to see that and. They said no, obviously, and then and then and, and, and then uh, Omar was like, "What? You're not gonna show it to me?" But did you show this other dude you're talking about? And they're like, "No, I didn't." And I was like, "Ah, oh, damn! Ah, oh, damn!" And and then Omar shared his he shared his not safe for Twitter account. Remember the one where he draws all the CP? Yeah, he shared that Twitter account to the 15 year old minor. The world is really big, big Christ. But like. He asked the 15 year old for dick pics. I want, I want you to like fully soak that in. And he is still on YouTube, like perfectly fine. 200,000 subscribers fine on YouTube. Uploaded yesterday a fine on YouTube. That's how Gucci is doing right now. As in unaffected, doing perfectly well on top of the world. And I am not happy with that right now. Like, like the worst part is I really, really don't want to make this video for the sole purpose that I really like used to like this guy. Like as I said, I like to listen to his music. I watch his videos. I was a fan. I was subscribed. The notification, you know, the notification bell was on. And then, and then you have to find out that like someone you like, you, whose content you enjoy and you think is pretty cool, is asking fifteen year olds for dick pics. Every YouTuber, like the second they make it really big, right? They have to, like, mm. all right, I have to go groom a child, I have to go traumatize some children. Go, why? I, I never understood that. Like, is it that hard to not? Is it that hard to not groom a child right after you make it big as a YouTuber? Is that like a very difficult thing? Like, the second you hit a thousand strokes, you're like, oh god, I have to groom a child now. Damn. Oh, that is so. I don't get it. I don't get pedophile here. I don't get grooming. I just. Uh, why can't people just not be pedophiles? It's. I'm. I'm not asking for it. What am I? Ugh. Anyhow, um, I'm hoping that whatever little people see this are slightly more educated about what. More has done and what he is doing, and that you can spread the message amongst your groups and just spread the word. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys maybe not next time. We're still it's hopefully funnier. Peter, don't turn me into marketable plushies. No.